Hey there guys, it is Mackimon, and today I will be doing a short tutorial on basically my building in action. Today I am doing a surprise birthday place for Oxit. This was uh, sponsored by Gavin, so uh, I'm not going to release this video until after the surprise has occurred, but I'm going to take you through building it. So uh, let's go ahead and get started. Um, first thing I'm gonna want to make is, um, I'm gonna jump right into the details. So, let's go ahead and make a cake real quick, because I'm feeling like that's gonna be my centerpiece. And let's make it very big, nice and large. Um, that's kind of what I want to go for. This is a big birthday. Gavin's spending a lot of money on this, trying to get it perfect for his friend Oxit. So, uh, let's go ahead and make it a layered cake. Giant layered cake. That looks good. There we go. Beautiful, beautiful. Okay, so I have my layered cake. I have no clue what flavor is Oxid's favorite, favorite flavor. So, uh, I'm gonna go ahead and go out on a limb here and just give it coloring. Not smooth. Let's do a uh, slate and give it kind of a, a cakey frosting texture look. And uh, I know what I want to do. I need some icing, little flowers or icing rouging along the top. Let me just pull this up. And uh, let's do, let's make it black. Or, yeah, that's that's a good color. I know what I want to do now. Okay, let's go ahead and delete this and pull this down here. Move this over here and turn this here. And I, I've made like a little ruching, a little decorative uh, feature to the cake. And what I want to do is pull this, not that much, uh, pull this out here. I changed my increment to 0.1. And uh, let's go ahead and pull this all the way over here too. So that looks good. And now what I'm going to do is select both and copy 15, copy 15, copy 15. And what I'm doing is I'm basically icing the cake how a real cake would be iced. I just go side by side and keep doing the same thing over and over and over. And uh, this, I, I've made a lot of cakes in my time. So uh, it's just, it comes naturally to ice a cake on a game too. Uh, but you can do it any way you want. So now that I have that, what I'm gonna do is, let's see, what do I wanna do? Let's go ahead and raise this up just a little bit, give it a little bit more depth. Uh, let's pull this there, and uh, so now I've selected all of my icing. I'm going to group it together, and uh, I'm going to use my handy dandy uh, resize model tool up here. Let me duplicate this, and my resize tool, this is where it comes in handy. I'm going to... ooh. Uh, that's not what I wanted to do. Hold on. I am going to pull this down, first of all. And uh, actually, that looks really nice. I think I'm going to keep that. But I'm going to duplicate this icing ring right here. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and set it so I want it 110% bigger. So let's keep resizing it until... I find one that I want. That looks good. Okay. So that has a nice frosted layer to it. Uh, I actually really like how it looks like it's draping over the cake. I think I'll keep it like that. Uh, that wasn't my original intention and you'll find that as you're building, sometimes you'll find interesting things that happen that you eventually end up keeping. And uh, that's what I'm going to do here. So I'm just going to keep going with that theme and uh, let's increase this 110% again, 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 there we go. And that looks very beautiful and perfectly iced. 
And uh, I'm not quite done yet because I need the bottom layer just to finish it up and make it look perfect. Now, there we go. That's an oxit cake for you, oxit. Sorry. All right. Um, now, every cake needs a topper. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to copy the hat that Oxic wears from another build that I did with, with him involved in it. And I'm going to bring it down and just, I got to put it just right, figure out how do I want this. Oh, that looks good. I like that. Okay. So now I need to break it and make it just ever so slightly bigger just to fit it perfect. There we go. Now we have an oxid cake. All right. So uh, let's go ahead and move it in the middle. And that looks about right. I think that's what I want it to be. And I'm very much pleased with this cake, so I'm going to go ahead and end that part there. And we'll move on to other bits in further videos. Thanks for watching. This is Makimon signing off. Later.